Welcome back to more Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. We got the Majin Buu arc. Here up next here in the Goku Saga, chapter number four. Let's not waste any time and let's get to it. I believe, oh, this first fight, I'm curious who this first fight is going to be. It could be Majin Vegeta. Like I, said, I don't think they got Yakan and all them guys in the game. So let's see how it goes. Here it goes. Yeah, okay, doing the World Tournament stuff first. Thanks to the father-son duo, Goku and Gohan, Earth enjoys seven years of peace until one day. Goku hears that Gohan has entered the world tournament and using the power of fortune teller Baba, he returns to Earth for just one day to participate. However, upon meeting another contender, a Supreme Kai, he learned that the terrifying Majin Buu is on the verge of resurrection. To prevent Buu's return, Goku steps away from the tournament he instead follows after the wizard Bobbity and defeats his subordinates. However, Bobbity leverages Vegeta's desire to settle the score with Goku to brainwash him. Yeah, so this is the fight they're going to have to do first. Bobbity uses his powers to send Goku and the others back to the tournament arena. Uh, are we back at the tournament arena? What's wrong with you? Heedless of the spectators around him, Vegeta fires off a key blast. Goku uses all his strength to try and stop it, but... V Vegeta! Vegeta, tell me it isn't true. You let Bobbity's spell take control of you, didn't you? Because doing something like this would make me fight you. It's true, isn't it? If I hadn't gone to these links, we wouldn't be about to fight. I had one day, one measly day in which to beat you, and I wasn't going to waste it standing around on that ship. That was your reasoning? You killed countless innocents to try and repair your meaningless pride? Meaningless? What do you know of meaningless? I don't give a damn about Majin Buu. All I want is my fight with Kakarot. Here and now, I will emerge as the victor once and for all. There's no reason he ever should have bested me. He and I are both Saiyans. But I was royalty among our people. I was a prince, yet he prevailed. He, he even had the impudence to save my life before. And that is an indignity I cannot bear! Poverty! Move us to some place where there's no one else around! I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here! <laughs> All right then, guess you can find somewhere else. <laughs> Whoop, let me skip the last part. This fight was so lit. Vegeta and Goku are transported to another location, but Vegeta remains under Bobbity's control. However, it turns out to be Vegeta's single-minded desire to defeat Goku that allows him to shake off Bobbity's total control. For you to go this far, you must have wanted to settle the score real badly, huh, Vegeta? Can't lie, I get it. This might. My bad, I don't know that little bit. Man, I was not prepared for that offer. It'll be over soon enough when I kill you. Uh, I haven't played in a few days, so a little bit rusty, but we'll see. All right, all right damn. I'm not saying shit. I don't forget how to what some color everything. Even <laughs> I forgot how to power up for a second. Him with that meteor crash, come on, bust him in the mouth, Goku. That's mean, right there. That is mean. Back by the others, this Majin Buu creature must be really as powerful as the Supreme Kai was saying. 
I already told you. The only thing that matters to me is this battle. Everyone else can die for Oh, snap. You're lying. Deep down, I know your soul is still the same, Vegeta. Man, he trying to hit us with the cheese for real. Look at that. Look at that. He literally tried to hit us with the cheese. Damn. All right. Oh, boy. Damn, he connected with that shit, too. You want to hit us with that mess? You can get it too. All right. Fine. Let's take care of this boo first. You wouldn't give me your best in this fight if you were too distracted. You still getting whooped. You are getting dropped before you can even finish. I know they're gonna try and end this fight. Nah. Get work. Get work. Yes, sir. I'm super saying two boys. That Goku was holding back is insane though. Goku intends to defeat Vegeta in Majin Buu, but Vegeta blindsides him and leaves with a sensu beam. He then risks his own life to attempt to defeat Buu himself. Oh man, this is one of my favorite scenes. Farewell, Bulma. Trunks. And even you, Kakarot. Doesn't have the same impact without the Bruce Falcorner thing and music and whatnot. However, just after Vegeta lands the final fatal blow, Majin Buu immediately revives, going on to destroy the world with Bobbity just as he wanted all along. We had the original Dragon Ball Z dub. That scene was amazing. Goku regains consciousness and he cannot sense Gohan's key, assumes he is dead. Now he must think of a plan to defeat Majin Buu. He lands upon teaching the fusion technique to his son Goten and Vegeta's son Trunks, which allow, uh, which will allow them to combine into a fiercely powerful new fighter. After hearing that Buu has gone to destroy West City, it's decided that Trunks will go rescue the Dragon Radar. In an attempt to buy some time, Goku interrupts Majin Buu and shows the monster his further awakened form. All right, here we go. Unfortunately, can't use the real music for this because <laughs> I damn sure would drop it in there. Oh, oh! Kill this guy first, right now! Goku didn't fight him in a base form. Somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobbin. Nobody asked for your opinion. Martin Boo is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every. Oh, we are smoke. Come on, Goku, get up. See if we can hit it. Come on. Hey, we have it. This is not the same meteor crash he ran. Oh, yeah, he did his Super Saiyan 2. That's fine. I don't even know. Yeah, we can't even transform. Oh, I didn't want to do this movie. Well, that's fine. Hey, it worked. We connected. That move really doesn't do that much damage, though. Oh! He's transforming on his own. Is this three? Nope. He just went to two. Okay. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Alright, bro. Stop spamming the key blast. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that. See if we can hit. Come on, come on. Let's stand right there. Stand right there! Oh, he did not! Damn, bro, we got no health now, man. Boo is whooping our ass, low key. All right, let's go. All right, now we got him. Now we got him, and we got him from behind too. All right, he's gonna turn around. You sleep? Oh no, oh um, no, you are not. You can be sleepy all you want, but we smacking you with this super command, man. Let's go. Heck no. He punched us out of it. What? Since when did punch? Since when you punching people out of ultimates? Oh, okay. Well, he's just doing it himself. All right. 
Hey. Let's go. Alright, man. Well, we're gonna have to refight Boo, cause damn. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. Real fight start now. Come on, can we connect? Alright, we're just gonna run into him and Okay, yeah. That makes sense. Come on. Come on, Goku. Let's whoop his ass. He didn't necessarily finish this fight. I'm curious if they're going to have us do it or not. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Connect it. Let's go. Hopefully that means he found the Dragon Raider and is leaving West City. Yeah, let's do it. Get Boo out of here. Let's go. Oh, we just saved that. <laughs> we just saved that one. Sheesh. Who just chilling in the water? <laughs> Look at him. Damn. Goku was able to buy sufficient time and use the instantaneous mission to return, leaving Majin Buu to kill Bobby and seize his independence. Goku expanded an extraordinary amount of ki during the fight, and as a result, can only remain on Earth for a little while longer. He pours everything he has into training Goten and Trunks up until they up until the very last minute. But unfortunately, the time for him to return to the lookout has come. Goku, I'm sorry, but it's about time we took you back to Otherworld. Right. I understand. What's the matter, Goten? Uh, Goten, honey. Do you want to give your dad a hug before he goes? Aw, oh, was that all? You should have said so, son. Bring it in. Goten, you take good care of your mom for me, okay? That's it, everybody. I'll see you all on the other side. I don't know how long Goku died. It was always like sad to see. <laughs> Especially the, this in like Cell. Goku, who has since returned to the other world, uses instant transmission to be reunited with Gohan when he senses him training in the land of the Kais. By chance, Gohan breaks Elder Kai's seal from 15 generations ago, and his latent potential is unleashed. Meanwhile, on Earth, Goten and Trunks have fused to become Gotenks. The Super Warrior puts his all into fighting Majin Buu, but is ultimately unable to defeat him. A now powered up Gohan then rushes to Earth to defeat Buu. Goku sees him off and watches on, the la and watches on from the land of the Kais. Unfortunately, Gohan finds himself struggling against Buu, who had grown stronger after absorbing Gotenks and Piccolo. With Elder Kai's life force, Goku returns to the living. He takes the Kai's Patara earrings, which promises power greater than fusion, and heads to Earth. Goku tries to use the Patara earrings to fuse with Gohan, but before he can, Gohan is absorbed by Boo, leaving Goku between a rock and a hard place. Vegeta, meanwhile, is brought to Earth with the help of fortune teller Baba. Goku tries asking him to fuse, but Vegeta rejects the idea outright. However, upon learning that Bulma has been killed and Trunks was absorbed, Vegeta has a change of heart. Ha ha! I finally found you! V Vegeta! Here and give it here! Right in this now. All right, let's whoop his ass. Ooh, 
This is the first time I fought with Vegeta. Oh, he's just going Super Vegeta. Okay. I've always liked Vegeta better than Gogeta. I don't know why. He, he just looks better to me. But granted, I, know, I, I, I guess I ain't the biggest fan of the fusion of the, of the fusion uh, like clothing. But Vegeta, I don't know. That <laughs> that dude tough. The bang attack? Oh. That is a different big bang attack than I'm used to seeing. This, this is light work. Oh my gosh. This is light work with Vegito. Holy crap. Whoop his ass. I don't know if I'm going to come up with this or not. Probably had too much health. Oh, we did get him. Wow. Wait. Is he actually doing a move? Oh, he left on like one? What? They let him live on one? Alright. Oh, no. He's not. Oh, okay. I say he's not living on one. He's just surviving everything. But never mind. Yeah, like, let's hope this plan's crazy enough to work. I guess we got more reading to do. Turn to that jawbreaker. Vegito finds just the right opening and then allows himself to be absorbed by Boo. At last, he rescues Gohan and the other others and brings them to safety. However, by saving Majin Buu in the form in which he first appeared, the Buu before them changes into the purest form, one that lacks all self-control. Having become the embodiment of absolute destruction, he wrecks havoc upon Earth. The Supreme Kai helps Goku and his friends flee the land to the. The Supreme Kai helps Goku and his friends flee to the land of the Kais, but Buu won't be deterred. Learning instant transmission, he goes after them. The battle then threatens to destroy the entire universe begins. Any mission that Boo Lily blew up Earth. Your strength is truly amazing. You've always been like this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. They got Vegeta talking. I'm gonna be quiet. They got the Vegeta speech in this bad boy. I need to just hit the restart, but I ain't going. Ever since the day I first met you, you were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. First, I thought it was your loved ones, but it was your blind instinct to protect them that spurred you on, pushed you beyond your limits. And certainly that was part of it. But over the years, I realized there was more, something else in the way you approach a battle. I used to fight for the sheer pleasure of it, sparing no one. I killed the dominance to feed my insatiable pride. I choose to fight to kill, or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. You showed mercy to everyone, even me. As if you knew one day I would possess the tiniest sliver of a soul. And here I am, fighting alongside you. I defy all logic. By some miracle, your compassion is rubbed off on me. Yet I still don't fully understand how you do it. How can you say and fight with such power, and at the same time be so gentle? Perhaps it's my anger that made me blind to the truth of Solo. Hey, Kekko, you are number one. Hey, boy, that one always... Hey, it, it, they did a great job with that in this, too. But that one always gave me chills. Anytime I rewatched or watched it, man, it was... Vegeta literally showing the character development. To a T right there. I don't. Oh boy. I wonder if they're gonna have us fight him more than once. Cause, sheesh. Cause we might get this done. I don't know if they're gonna try and oh uh, unlock it where you can get the spear bomb. Oh boy. What do you think I've been trying to do? I just haven't had a chance to concentrate. Can't focus my power. Ah, it's it's to so hard when he keeps coming at me. 
only need a minute. One minute, that's all. Oh, that might do it. See, this ends him. See ya, boo. And he's gone. Let's go. All right, that, so I'm curious if that's gonna be. Oh no. While he's occupied, you power up. Okay, so we might be fighting him a second time. I'm curious. Either that or we kind of hit a little branch timeline there. We'll see. Yeah, then we're going to fight him again. Vegeta tries to buy time, but Majin Buu defeats him. It is now that Mr. Satan appears and declares that he will vanquish Majin Buu himself. <laughs> Seeing this, Majin Buu attempts to kill Mr. Satan, which shouldn't have been very hard for him at all. He was trolling the hell out of him. But the original Majin Buu splits from Majin Buu and begins to defend Mr. Satan. However, he does not last long. Goku, who is supposed to have been building up his ki, gets exhausted and in turn cannot sustain his transformation. Vegeta smiles wryly, realizing that the tide has turned against them. But he also has an idea. Hey, Supreme Kai and Dende! Do you hear me up there? If you can, then say something, damn it! Vegeta! <laughs> he issues orders to Dende and the others and gathers the Namekian Dragon Balls. Vegeta then proceeds to revive Earth and all the people killed by Majin Buu. I think it's about time we let the people of Earth shoulder the burden for once. The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit bomb. But even if I collect a little energy from all the people who are brought back, it still won't be enough to take down Boo! It won't just be a little bit. You'll get every ounce of spirit energy they can spare! <laughs> I really want to use the spirit bomb, Vegeta. Since I caught it to go, I kind of feel like a brown dad! Okay, guys, it's all set! Man, <laughs> King Kai. And you can speak not to just Earth, but the whole universe if you want! That's more like it. Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? I like this new side of you, Vegeta. Nice going. Here we go. People of Earth, give me your energy. We need you. It's ready. I thought it was going to have to fight again. Go! You're an incredible warrior, Boo. It was you against the universe, and you nearly won. I hope you can come back once more, but good. I want to fight you again, one-on-one, -on -one, without all the loss. I'll be right there waiting for you, only stronger. Later. Even Majin Buu is defeated by the spirit bomb, and Goku and the others return safety to Earth. All the friends come home to greet them, including their families. You mean you can stay now? We can all be together like a real family? You and Gohan and Goten are back and there's no catch? That's right! I can't wait to get to Mount Paozu and have some of your good old home cooking, Chi-Chi. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi, why are you crying? I thought it was good news. Goku is alive once more and has defeated Boo. Now he returns to his life as a family man. Uh, let's see. I, don't, I mean, I don't know what. I don't know if they're finna show anything else next. I know next is like the Battle of Gods arc, so I guess that should be next. Yep. Ooh, unlocked. Ooh. All right. Cool. Yeah, God of Destruction and the Freeze of Resurrection art. Okay. So all that is next. We are done. It does not look like there were any branch paths, I guess, for the Boo arc. Yeah, it doesn't. Because the other ones, you can see, like, with Sail, it showed. Oh. Father and Son say farewell. Oh. Huh. 
Oh, no, there is. Oh, we're down. Oh, there is one. We'd have to go back to do that, but. Is this anything here? No, nope, it's just him. I don't know what the blue marker indicates, but. What is detail, so? Yeah, this should just reduce his health. And then it would split off into something. I mean, I ended up just beating Boo, so. Huh. I don't know. What what does the blue thing say? It, there's no details for that. Okay, well. Huh. I, I'm curious what, what that branch is off to. So, I guess we'll try and just reduce his health and see how that goes. And then we'll You're wrap good. things up here. But I don't... Because huh, we just flat out beat Boo, so. All right, Martin. Kill this guy first. Right now. Damn, he is doing something. I don't know why Goku didn't. I, I haven't seen it in a while. I don't remember Goku fighting him like this. Reduce Majin Buu's health. Reduce Majin Buu's health quickly. I mean, which one? Uh, I don't know which one we're supposed to be doing. I think we're supposed to be re just reducing. And he obeys my every command. If he knows what's good for him. Super spread, oh snap. It's ready. Damn, can we hit him? Ah, we missed. Oh, he was flying up. I wonder if we can... Uh, I wonder if we're supposed to defeat him quickly. Maybe we're supposed to beat him before Super Saiyan 3. Come on, Goku. Hit him. Let's read that something. See you around. Yeah, something tells them we're supposed to do this before he uh turns Super Saiyan 3. Alright. Okay, well that's Super Saiyan 2, I'm guessing he jumps. Is that what he jumped to? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Don't waste our time. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Ooh, is this a super? Come here, man. I, I, I don't call it. Here it is. Okay. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. Right. But further beyond that. Gotta see if we can get to Boo real quick. Finish him off. Get ready to see my ah, crap. Well. Yeah, we, we were moving too slow then. All right, well, let's retry it. I'm pretty sure this is a... We got to do it fast. Come on, big guy. Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobbity? Nobody asks for your opinion. Martin B is my loyal servant. And he obeys my every command. If Come on, Goku, go in here. We might have to hit this like two, three times. It's ready. Let's see how much this does. Let's read Because we just we just dropped him down to that fourth. Alright, that does like one and a half. Oh, Goku, hey, up and power up. Come on. Get ready to see my oh, boy. He is transforming fast as hell. <laughs> Don't waste our time. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick. And look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that. Yeah, man, he's got a... He's turning into Super Saiyan 2 and 3 too fast. And this isn't going to be enough to kill him. Okay, yeah, well, where are we? Let's do this already. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't so much know. Longer than the others, but I haven't had as much I, mean, I feel like I'm doing this pretty fast. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. I 
consider it an honor. All right, well, we finished it as fast as I thought. But. Finish off this long-haired cretin already. We've got places to be. That is a bit different dialogue, though. Uh, let's see. Maybe we did get it. Maybe it's not before Super Saiyan 3. I don't know. No, it's looking like the same thing. Or are we? Or did we do it too fast? Oh wait. All right, so went back to this. So just get through. Throughout the battle, Bobbity has pushed Boo until his breaking point. Finally, Boo snaps and kills Bobbity outright. Goku talks to Boo about giving up his evil ways. Boo promises he'll stop, but only on the condition he can have candy and someone to fight. After telling everyone everything that's happened, Goku uses the Dragon Balls to revive the people that Boo has killed. He explains that wiping the memory of Majin Buu should solve any issues, and everyone agrees with his solution. The reformed Majin Buu now lives happily at Capsule Corporation and is a great playmate for Goten, or for Trunks and Goten. It's unbelievable! The dreaded Majin Buu living a peaceful, carefree life on a planet he once threatened? I never could have expected this outcome. Okay, well, I just skipped. I thought it was going to be the same thing. Well, right, I just skipped it, so I'll probably try and do it again. Yeah, it's crazy, all right. But I'm really, really glad it worked out this way. It would have been such a shame for him to just die. Yeah, how do you figure? Well, Majin Buu was so strong that he could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, even in my Super Saiyan 3 form, right? Think of how great a rival he'd be for the next generation of fighters, like Gohan and Goten. Plus, most of my fiercest rivals are now some of my best friends. <laughs> I tell you, you might be the only guy in the whole universe who'd think a planet-destroying freak of nature would be a shame to let die. I'm serious, though. Honestly, I don't even think Boo would have been a bad guy to begin with if he wasn't manipulated by somebody as evil as Bobbity. <laughs> you may be right. Your track record shows you know how to bring out the good and even some of the worst people. <laughs> I just do what I do. With everything settled down now, it would have been really cool to fight Majin Buu at full power just one more time. But hey, maybe it'll happen someday. Alright, so that's how that was. So we just have to finish him off. I guess it, I guess it wasn't before the, the third one, but all right, well, that is the Majin Buu art. Next time out, we will have the, the Battle of Gods art. So, there, yeah, there really wasn't any branch timelines for this one, but oh, well, you know, they kept it pretty simple there. So, yeah, that's where we're going to go ahead and wrap it up, everybody. If you guys enjoyed it, man, make sure you guys hit the like button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on the whole game. If you guys are enjoying it, if you guys are playing it and whatnot. If you guys are enjoying the Dragon Ball Spark and Zero content, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for me. As we're on that road to a thousand. Next time we'll be taking on Beerus and Golden Frieza. We'll see how that one ends up working out for us. But that is where we're gonna go ahead and bring it to a close. I'm up to next time, everybody. Hope you guys stay safe out there. As always, God bless and peace. Close it out, future. And it's the love from my fans got me still here.